Use a cylinder for the main body and add additional shapes for the barrel sliding grip. Yeah, honestly, this looks like a deagle to me. I don't know. I don't know what you guys are on. Like, this is fine. Everyone's been going so crazy about the new Roblox AI, like it can do all this random crap, it can make game ideas for you, it can help you write scripts, but you know, I don't really care about any of that stuff, it just, it doesn't mean anything to me. The only thing that matters to me is 3D modeling. So today we're going to find out if this AI can actually make a 3D model or even just help you make 3D models in general. If it can, then it's awesome, it's great AI and you should definitely use it. But if it can't even make a 3D model, just delete Roblox Studio. It's not even worth using at that point. All right, uh, I'm in a new Roblox Studio place. Yeah, we got the assistant up here. Let's just see what it can do. All right, let's start off with something basic like, I don't know, give me a game idea. Come on, baby, you can do it. See, creating game where players can build their own city and destroy this room. All right, so it, it works pretty good. Like, you you could maybe do something with that. I don't really know, but it works. That's, that's all we need to know. Hey, let's take it a step further. Uh, show me how to uh, make a gun. Holy, create a new tool object in Roblox Studio, go to the explore window and hover over workspace. So it's just, it's just telling me to steal assets from the library? Bro, uh, so far I'm giving the AI zero stars, this is complete garbage, it's literally promoting plagiarism. Alright, let's, let's try one more thing. How can I model a gun myself? There we go. Let's make this a little bit bigger. Let's see. To model a gun yourself, you can use a third-party modeling application such as Blender, or... What the hell is that? No, 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 you know what? I I'm done. That's a little bit better. Open Roblox Studio, select the move tool. Oh, it's telling me to create it. Okay, with unions and intersections. Oh, I really don't want to do that. Uh, so far, the modeling advice has been pretty bad, so let's, let's try to be more specific as to what I'm trying to do. Let's say, how can I make a gun myself in Blender? To make a gun in Blender for use in Roblox, you can follow these steps. Open Blender, create a new project. Model a gun using Blender's modeling tools. Okay, okay. Oh, okay, I like this, I like this. Oh, what? Okay, now it tells me not to copy other people. Holy! Bro's more hypocritical than a damn politician. Once you finish modeling the gun, you can set up the asset in Blender to reduce importing rendering issues later in Roblox Studio. All right, um, so really the only modeling advice it, it's giving me is right here. Uh, extruding, scaling, rotating vertices, edges, and faces. So it's telling me to make a gun by extruding, scaling, and rotating. That's kind of difficult. All right, let's see what we can do. <sighs> Extrude, scale, and rotate. All right, tap into edit mode. Scale you like this. Um, extrude you. We can rotate you right here. Scale a little bit on the X. I think I'm doing that right. Yeah. Extrude, scale, rotate, extrude, rotate. Oh, I can't even move the faces, dude. Extrude, rotate. Oh my gosh. Hold on a minute. Extrude, rotate. Okay, now we can rotate the 90. That looks really bad. Scale you up like that. Oh, uh, I guess we can extrude you. Scale, extrude down. Extrude you along like that. Oh, extrude, scale. No, hold on. Extrude you. Extrude you out like that. Now we can scale him way in. Oh, there we go. Now we extrude him in. We got a little uh, little trigger at the end. Uh, extrude, scale, extrude. It. Oh, <laughs> Um, we're, we're not, we're not off to a very good start. This, this, it's just, it doesn't look that good. Surely it can do more than that though. Surely this thing can go step by step and like actually give me some advice. Step by step. How do I model a gun? in Blender. Come on. Open Blender and create a new project. Okay. Blender's modeling tools to create the shape of the gun. A basic shape such as cylinder cube then modify to resemble a gun. Okay. Yeah, so it really doesn't give you much detail on like actually using Blender. Like this is as much as it can go into. I really want to just badger this thing until I can get some actual detail out of it because that's where the real like modeling tips are going to come from. Okay. Extrude tool allows you to create new geometry by extending existing faces, edges, or vertices. Okay. Scale, um, resize something, rotate, bevel, loop cut boolean uh okay i like that these are just a few examples of the modeling tools in blender they can create in 3d models okay like this is it's a little bit better like there's definitely a lot more detail here but even still the thing it's missing is the application of these tools and what you can use to make them like it'll tell you how to make a gun and then it tells you how the tools work but it doesn't tell you how to use the tool to make a gun if that makes any sense so so far it's it's really not that good for modeling but there's a couple more things i want to try generate a gun model for me can it spawn in a model itself 
itself. Let's see. You can only provide guidance on how to build, grow, and monetize Rolex creations. I cannot generate a gun model for you, bro. Bro. Okay, I can guide you on how to create a gun model in Blender. Let's just say, I don't know, it's a deagle. So I guess it, it can try to guide me on like how to make it, but it doesn't really, it can't spawn models itself. Tools to create the the deagle gun, start with the cylinder for the main body. Start start with a cylinder for the main body? Are you high? Add additional shapes for the barrel, slide and grip. All right. Uh, trigger sights, magazine, release, round off edges. See, once again, it's just really generic. Like that's, you can't do a whole lot with that advice. Wow, can't spawn models, doesn't give good advice. Bro, I'd, I don't know what to do. Like this, this is really really crappy ai for for making 3d models let's see if we can do something really simple though like i don't know guide me through spawning a cube in blender open blender create a new project in the 3d report press shift a or go to the ad menu select mesh and then cube oh get rid of you shift a mesh and then select cube it actually told me how to do something bro all right, that's giving me a little bit more hope for this thing. Like, it was being really, really crappy before, but this is good advice. This is step-by-step. Step. This is step-by-step, step, like, how you do something. You can com you can apply this. You can apply this to any project you want. Like, it's so basic. And Blender literally already has a cube when you open up a new project. But, hey, it's something, guys. Modern AI is only a couple years old. Like, it'll get better. You know, final thoughts, though? It works. Like, I guess you could, you could do a couple things with it, but I don't know, man man. It's, I was kind of disappointed by it. The best it could do was show me step by step how to spawn in a cube and give me some really, really shady details on how to make a gun. And a gun's really not that complex because of how many variations there are. It's, it's pretty simple. Like it could have said, I don't know, add in something for the main body, model that, then model the trigger, use a reference image to trace the barrel part of it, uh, extrude it in so you have a place for the bullets to come out from. But no, nah, none of that. Just use a cylinder for the main body and add additional shapes for the barrel sliding grip. Okay, well, according to the AI, I'm done with my Desert Eagle. Yep, here, here's here's the uh, the cylinder for the main body. Then we have the uh, the additional shapes for the barrel slide and trigger, or whatever the hell it said. Yeah, honestly, this looks like a Deagle to me. I don't know, I don't know what you guys are on. Like, this is fine. This is the best 3D AI in the world. It it told me exactly how to put this together. What a revolutionary time we're living through. You're better off wasting your time with a ducky 3D tutorial than trying to use the AI for Blender help. You know, if I'm gonna promote tutorial. I might as well promote my own. You're literally better off using my tutorials than trying to get advice from that freaking Roblox AI thing. And that's saying something, because my tutorials are total shit. Well, uh, this was a waste of a video. Moral of the story, uh, Roblox AI is horrible for 3D modeling. It's not going to do anything for you. Uh, there's going to be some people whining in the comments like, uh, it, was, it wasn't meant for 3D modeling. It, it was meant for scripting. You weren't using it for its intended purpose. I don't care. If it can't 3D model, it has no business with me. Uh, Roblox, you suck. Roblox Studio sucks. Uh, the AI is horrible. Never use Roblox again. Boycott it. Maya sucks. Blender is the only way to go. Have a lovely day.